Welcome to the world of bats. Have you ever seen a bat flying through the night sky? Bats are amazing creatures. They are the only mammals that can truly fly. That means, unlike other animals that glide, bats flap their wings to soar through the air. Bats are nocturnal, which means they are most active at night. While we sleep soundly in our beds, bats are busy hunting for food and taking care of their babies. But don't worry, bats are not scary at all. In fact, they are incredibly helpful to our planet. Let's learn more about these fascinating creatures and discover why they are so bat-tastic. Are you ready for an adventure into the world of bats? Let's go! So many bats, so little time. Did you know that there are over 1,400 different types of bats? That's right. Bats come in all shapes and sizes, from the tiny bumblebee bat, which is smaller than your thumb, to the giant flying fox bat, which has a wingspan bigger than a human. Some bats have big ears, like the long-eared bat. Others have funny noses, like the leaf-nosed bat. And some bats even have bright colors, like the Honduran white bat with its fluffy white fur. Each bat species has unique features that help them survive in their environment. Isn't it incredible how diverse the bat family is? Where do all these bats hang out? Bats can be found all over the world, except in extremely cold places like the North and South Poles. They live on every continent except Antarctica. You might find bats roosting in caves, hanging upside down like furry decorations. Some bats prefer to make their homes in trees, snuggling up in tree hollows or under loose bark. Others find shelter in abandoned buildings, under bridges or even in mines. No matter where they live, bats are experts at finding safe and cosy places to rest during the day. Imagine being a bat, hanging upside down all day. It might seem strange to us, but it's perfectly normal for a bat. In fact, hanging upside down helps them take flight quickly when it's time to hunt for food. The magic of echolocation, seeing in the dark. Have you ever wondered how bats find their way around in the dark? They have a superpower called echolocation. It's like having built-in night vision goggles. Bats make high-pitched sounds that we can't even hear. These sounds bounce off objects like trees, insects, and even you. The bat listens carefully to the echoes that come back. By listening to the echoes, bats can see in complete darkness and even catch their prey in midair. It's like playing a game of sound tag. Echolocation helps bats navigate, find food, and avoid obstacles in the dark. It's one of the coolest things about these amazing creatures. Bugs or fruit? Dinner time for bats. Bugs or fruit? Just like us, different bats have different tastes when it comes to food. Some bats are insectivores, which means they love to eat insects. In fact, a single brown bat can eat thousands of mosquitoes in one night. That's a lot of bug-eating power. Other bats are frugivores, and they enjoy feasting on sweet, juicy fruits. These bats are important seed dispersers because they help spread fruit seeds to new areas, allowing plants to grow in different places. Whether it's crunchy insects or delicious fruits, bats play a vital role in keeping our ecosystem in balance. They are like tiny superheroes of the night, working hard to keep our planet healthy. More helpful than scary. Vampire bats. You might have heard scary stories about vampire bats, but don't worry. Vampire bats are not as scary as they sound. It's true that they drink blood, but they only need a tiny amount, and they usually get it from cows or horses. Vampire bats have a special enzyme in their saliva that prevents blood from clotting, which is actually helpful for medical research. 
Scientists study this enzyme to develop medicines for people with blood clotting disorders. So, while vampire bats might seem a little spooky, they are actually quite fascinating and even helpful in their own way. Remember, it's important to learn the truth about animals and not believe everything we hear in scary stories.